Hi, welcome back to my channel 5 by me maths. This is Pai Chuvasudeva. Question number 9. The equation 3 over x plus 5 equals negative 2x plus c has no real roots. Find the range of possible values of c. This question got 7 marks. The question says this equation has no real roots. So first you need to frame a quadratic equation. Multiply everything by x. So you get 3 plus 5x equals negative 2x squared plus cx. Multiply everything by x. Write everything one side. 2x squared minus cx plus 5x plus 3 is 0. And you can take x as a common factor here. You get 2x squared plus 5 minus c times x plus 3 is 0. Here a is the coefficient of x squared, b is the coefficient of x which is 5 minus c, c is the constant term. Now if the function has no real roots, you must have learned this in the topic discriminant b square minus 4ac should be less than 0. So b square 5 minus c whole square minus 4ac should be less than 0. So you need to frame a quadratic equation in terms of c and solve it. So you expand this, you will get c square minus 10c plus 25 minus, minus 4 2s are 8, 8 3s are 24 is less than 0. So the quadratic equation here is c square minus 10c plus 1 is less than 0. So this is a quadratic inequality. To solve this quadratic inequality, first you need to find the two c values. The two c values are 5 plus 2 root of 6 and 5 minus 2 square root of 6. You got two c values. If you sketch this graph, this little graph, both numbers are positive but this is a smaller number. So let's say you have 5 minus 2 root of 6 here, 5 plus 2 root of 6 here. The quotient of c square is positive, so you get this graph. When they say the function is less than 0, they are talking about this part of the graph, the graph that lies below the x-axis. So for the connected graph, the corresponding x value, in this case the c value will be the smaller number is less than c, is less than the bigger number, that's the solution.